Moscow warns of conflict with NATO, Ukraine says Russia changed targets in the east. Ukraine says Russia is increasing its shelling in Donetsk to protect annexed areas. Moscow warned that the risk of conflict with NATO spilled up. According to Reuters, on December 8, local time, the governor of the Donetsk region Pavlo Kirilenko said that the Russian army is continuously shelling the frontline areas in eastern Ukraine. This is said to be the Kremlin's strategy to reduce the scale of the fighting, to protect the controlled areas. The fiercest front now is near the cities of Bakhmut and Aldiuka. In addition, Russian forces are also trying to reach Lyman, an area that Ukraine recaptured in November. In the areas adjacent to Luhansk province, we also intercepted a series of missiles, Kirilenko said. On the same day, the military command of Ukraine announced that the country's air defense forces shot down several missiles in the Kharkiv and Mykolaiv regions. For now, the Kremlin still aims to control most of the territories in eastern and southern Ukraine that Russia has claimed to have annexed. Russia warns the risk of conflict with NATO spikes. According to Newsweek, on December 8, local time, Russian Deputy Foreign Minister Sergei Ryabkov warned NATO about the risk of conflict surging if the alliance continues to intervene in the special military operation. Separate. NATO members seem to be increasingly interested in getting directly involved in Ukraine. Their support for Kiev is much more diverse than it was a few months ago. This is a deliberate policy of the United States and allies to escalate the conflict. They are playing with fire, the danger is soaring, Ryabkov said. According to Deputy Minister Ryabkov, Moscow is conducting bilateral diplomatic negotiations with Western countries on the situation in Ukraine.